Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. I hope you all are doing really well. Before we dive in, let's take a quick moment to make sure that you are subscribed and you're turning on the bell notification so you never miss when I upload. I honestly can't believe this is my fourth video in this series. I am so glad you guys are loving it so much. I'll include the playlist in the description of the other three Amazon activewear videos just in case you missed them. But overall, I post tons of hauls, styling content, and daily vlogs too. So I really hope you join our little fam. So getting into this video, I always take your feedback and try to find dupes for the products that you want dupes for. A few of the latest suggestions that I got were for Lululemon high impact sports bras, Aritzia type of sweatpants, leggings with pockets in them, and ebb to street or longer type of crop tank top. So I got you covered and so much more. In true fashion for my Amazon activewear videos, I have so much to share with you guys. So I don't want to waste any more time. Let's just go ahead and jump on into this. I'm going to go ahead and start with sports bras. The first one I wanted to share with you guys is this seamless wireless sports bra. All the brand names, just as a heads up, will be listed down in the description along with the size I got, the price, and a link to the item as well. Everything will be in order of when I talked about it and also I did purchase everything off of the US Amazon website, so I figured I would mention that. Getting back into the sports bra, I am so excited I found this. This is the perfect dupe for the Lululemon In Light bra. And the best part about this is the fact that it's $40. The In Light bra is $100 and some other variations of the inlight bra are over a hundred dollars which is insane for a sports bra this is the perfect high impact sports bra your girls will not be going anywhere whether you want to go running or training in this sort of sports bra this is perfect for you. This sports bra is based off of your actual bra size. So I got this in a 32D. It's so comfortable on all of the edges and everything. It's just completely seamless. I love the crisscross detail on the light bra. So I of course love this back as well. It has a normal hook bra closure on the back too. So this might be just for me, but I do wish that they had this in a 30 band. The lowest that they had was a 32. And as you can see, when I'm trying it on, it is a little bit loose and it provides a little bit of gapping in the back because of that too so i wish that they offer this in a 30 band and i think that it would have fit a lot more snug against my body but if you are a 32 band or higher this is going to be the perfect sports bra i would definitely go with your true to size bra size in this and this will fit so perfect for you so for the next sports bra it is this little cute racer back bra right here this you guys is probably one of my favorite sports bras from this entire haul it reminds me so much of the lululemon in alignment bra that's a fairly new addition to Lululemon's collection of sports bras. And I got that one probably roughly a month ago and I've been wearing it nonstop. It's so good. But the silhouette of this is identical to that one. It has a little bit of a V in the front and then just a complete racer back, simple detail in the back of this. The In Alignment Sports Bra has Nulu fabric, which is the same fabric as all the Align products. And this one is more of like a nylon sort of fabric. It's still very soft. I thought it was like cotton at first, but it's nylon and it will be sweat wicking as well. This one seems super supportive. It provides really great coverage. And I like these type of sports bras because not only are they great for just normal workouts, yoga training sort of thing, but also I love these sort of sports bras for day-to-day -day wear too. So I'm very obsessed with this one and I would highly recommend that you check this one out. The next sports bra I picked up is this white one. So this one very loosely reminds me of the free to be elevated bra from Lululemon. And the reason why I say that is because of like this crisscross in detail in the back. But regardless of how closely it reminds me of it, I love this sports bra. Again, this one provides really good coverage. I think it's going to be really good for more high impact workouts. It has removable padding in it and the fabric is a nylon spandex mix so it's definitely nice and comfortable i love the white color in this i got it in a size extra small and i can't believe that this was only 17 dollars. i think i spent 16.99 on it super incredible it comes in multiple colors too next up is another high impact sports bra i feel like this one is a combination between the lululemon run times bra because of the mesh paneling in the front of it and also the swift speed bra because of these straps these straps are adjustable which is 
really nice. I like that little detail. It really helps to secure the girls and make sure that they don't go anywhere. But what I love about this bra is that it is also convertible. You can wear it as normal like straight straps, but it also has a little hook in the back. So if you want to wear it racer back, you totally can as well. And the bottom half of these straps are mesh too. So it's just going to be super breathable. This does have a normal bra like class closure on the back. I really love this bra because I feel like for high impact sports bras or even sports bras made for bigger cup sizes, it's really hard to find at sports bras that look really cute. So I love that this one is so cute and it's still like a little bit more minimal. So love this one. The last of the sports bras is this super cute, like super strappy one. This one definitely reminds me of the Lululemon Free to Be Wild long line sports bra. I love the strappy detail on the back of this. It adds just the right touch and then the straps are the perfect length too. I got this in a color called Khaki Fog and I love, love, love this color. Me and browns have been like a whole thing this entire season and I'm just so drawn to them. So really excited about this color. I got this in a size extra small and it was $24, super reasonable price point. There is removable padding in this, which is great. The lower half of this, like the long line part of this is kind of like loose on my body, but I'm really happy that the bands above it at least is tight. So my girls definitely aren't going anywhere with this sports bra. So I just figured I would mention that. I also love long line sports bras because they meet right at the top of your high-waisted leggings. So if you didn't want to wear a tank top and you just wanted to wear just a sports bra, then the long line sports bras are the perfect option for you. So moving right into tops next, if you requested ebb to street variation tops, the next three are for you. These are such good dupes. I'm so excited for them. So the first one being this racer back crop top. It is more of like a longer crop length, which I love. So it'll definitely hit right at the top of high-waisted leggings. This is a dupe for the Ebb Street racer back crop tank top. This version from Lululemon has more of like a haltered style front to it with the racer back back to it. So I love this version of it because of the front detail. I'm so obsessed with haltered style tank tops because they definitely provide all of the coverage in the front that I love in my tank tops. This one in particular does have kind of like thicker padding so just take note of that. I personally would remove it but I did keep it in during the try on and now so that you guys can see what it looks like in. Also if you are a larger cup size I would just be mindful of this haltered style. It does cut in quite a bit so you could lose some coverage on the side of your boobs. So I feel like I'm a little bit on edge on that, but I still really love this top. It comes in so many colors and just the fabric and the feel of it reminds me so much of the Epta Street. The next one is more of the original Epta Street tank top that I was kind of referring to. So this is definitely the longer version. So for those that like more coverage, potentially even like covering your butt, this is like the perfect tank top for you. This one comes in so many colors too. I got it in like, they call it a grayish green but it's definitely kind of like a sage green to me. I got this in a size small and even the small fits me really really well and it was a little bit cheaper than the last one at $18.99. This one I did remove the padding in it because the padding was not only thick padding but it was like push-up padding. I, it just did not look good. So I removed it for this one, but it does have obviously a built-in bra in this. So you'll still get the support you want for your girls. It does have a racer back detail and I love just like the scoop neck on it. It is really flattering. It still provides like good coverage. Fabric is really good quality too, super stretchy. And lastly, if you liked this one, but you wanted something that was like a little bit shorter, you didn't want something so long, well, I have a third option for you. So here is the next one that is just like the Ebb Street bra, but definitely more cropped. I love this one so much. The material on all of these are exactly identical, which is great. And the quality seems fantastic on them too. This one has better padding than the last one. So I just left it in, but it does have a built-in bra in this. So it's removable. You can take it out if you don't want like the padding there. This I obviously got in black, but they do have it in so many other colors. I got it in a size extra small and it was $22. I think that this is a fantastic price for this. I think that the original Ebb Street bras, what did it go for over $40? So half the price and completely the same look too. I think the straps are a little bit thinner than the Ebda Street one, but this one is so comfortable and it's definitely one of my favorites from this haul. Speaking of favorites, I am so obsessed with this next tank top. 
Oh, you guys. This one reminds me of the Lululemon shorter length cool racerback tank top. It's a little bit more cropped than even like the shorter length one, but just the style of it definitely very loosely reminds me of it. Even like the material is pretty similar. This one is so soft. It's so comfortable to wear really good coverage yet again i am such a fan of just like thicker straps with the racer back it does have built-in padding yet again that is removable and a built-in bra too i am so obsessed with this light gray color but they also have this in like 12 different colors i of course want to get it in black and white stable colors but they also have it like in this really gorgeous grayish blue and grayish green colors too oh i feel like i need them especially for the upcoming season going hiking or whatever it may be. I think that these would be perfect for that. Quality is completely there with this too. It is just really nice and it's thicker material too. Oh, I'm so obsessed. <laughs> Next up is a black cropped tank top. This one is just like the classic silhouette that I feel like everybody needs in their wardrobe. This one is so versatile. It's great to go to the gym in. It's great for athleisure. It's great for any sort of outdoor activities or even wearing like more casually too. This one definitely has more of like the athletic material to it. Something that's like sweat wicking. It has a built-in bra in it too, but this one is definitely a good option if you want something just with more coverage, something that's a little bit longer, something that's not too racer back. It's more like full coverage in the back too. Such a great, staple piece to add to your athletic wardrobe. This next tank top, I was so happy to find on Amazon. It's actually so crazy how closely this reminds me of the Free People Happiness Runs tank top. Whether that is the short version or the long version, there's two different versions of it. This one is the long version, but they also offer it in crop too. That one is hands down one of my favorite tank tops. I actually mentioned it in my top 15 favorite t-shirts and tank tops video that I posted a couple of weeks back love that free people one so again i was so happy to find this one because it is the exact same it's the exact same like seamless material that just completely hugs to your body of course it doesn't have like 50 different color options it has probably about five or so even the sizing is pretty similar this one is an extra small small and that's how free people does the sizing too on this top but i got it in this gorgeous gray color and the best part about it is the fact that this was ten dollars i think it was 9.98 and the free people one is anywhere from 30 to 40 dollars so are you kidding me for the exact same top such a good find. I'm so excited for this one. So I do have one jacket to share with you. It is this beauty right here. This one very closely reminds me of the Define jacket, but in no means is it the Define jacket. It doesn't have any pockets or anything like that. This is the perfect lightweight spring summer jacket option, especially if you're going hiking or walking or something outdoors in the morning where it's kind of like still a little bit brisk. This is the perfect option to just throw on because it is so lightweight. You can even transition into the fall time with this if you want to put this on underneath like a vest or something oh i'm so excited for this piece i love it so much because one like the zipper is so satisfying <laughs> to zip up and down and two it's just a shorter length jacket i feel like i always fight with the defined jackets at lululemon because i feel like they're still just a little too long they kind of hit or go past like my butt but i love that this one is a little bit more cropped but it still has the same silhouette where it's longer in the front and the back and then it kind of like tapers up on the sides a little bit this one i did get it in black they do have it in multiple colors too and i ended up getting it in a size small i will say for this this runs really small so definitely size up in it the arms are tight on me so i feel like this fits more like a, an extra small or even like an extra extra small otherwise this is 26.99 27 dollars and i think it's great like the quality is fantastic it's definitely not super soft but it is still comfortable to wear this is definitely a jacket that i was missing in my wardrobe so glad i found it Okay, next category, we're heading right into shorts. I'm gonna try to speed things up a bit because I definitely don't want this video to be like 30 or 40 minutes long. So the next pair I wanted to share with you guys is like these loose running shorts. They're a four inch inseam. It's in this gorgeous color, which is called Lunar Rock which is so funny because that's a Lululemon color. But these ones remind me so much of the Lululemon Hottie Hot shorts. Like, I mean, come on. So closely related. The only differences to it is that the Hottie Hot shorts do not have jawstrings, but this one does. It also has like a reflective detail on the back of it and then a small little pocket too. I'm not a big fan of the pocket. It's just like this little miniature pocket. It's so kind of weird. But these shorts fit so freaking good that I can kind of 
of like overlook this part. It has a built-in liner in it, just like the Lululemon shorts do. Super good quality. They're super comfortable to wear. It has a little mesh paneling on the side. And for a rise, I would say that these are more of like a mid rise. I feel like they're pretty close to showing my belly button. I definitely would have loved if they had this in a higher rise, but it's the same battle that I fight with Lululemon shorts too. The Hottie Hot shorts and a few other ones. They just don't go high enough rise for me. Great option for running shorts or even just like more casual shorts for running errands or going to the beach or anything like that too. Okay, so I was on a mission to try to find dupes for the line shorts. This has been a long journey of mine, probably spanning across most of the videos that I've done in this series. I still want to find like something more close. These ones are definitely closer to the real deal. I have two different pairs to share with you. These are two different brands as well. One is in the eight inch inseam and the other is in a five inch inseam. You guys know I don't really wear the eight inch inseam. It's just too long on my petite frame. I feel like the longest I can go is six inches, but I definitely wanted to try these out for you guys and my taller girls out there to see if this is a good pair to pick up. I definitely think that it's worth picking these up and trying out. They're only $20, which is insane. I got this in a size extra extra small. It's in this khaki fog color is the name of it. The fabric is not a lines, but it's closely related. It has a very lightweight, naked feeling to it. The crotch seams are really similar. I just think that the front part of the seam is a little long. So I feel like you could get camel toe in this fairly easy, but it's super high rise. They're really comfortable to wear. It V's in the back to just like align shorts and leggings do. If you love to wear bike shorts with long oversized t-shirts, then I don't think that this crotch issue is going to be a problem for you, especially if you're just going to be covered it anyways I think this is a really really great option and it comes in multiple colors too heading to the next one this is in a light gray color it kind of comes off almost with a little purple tones in it it's gorgeous nonetheless this one is a five inch inseam so very much within the inseam range that I prefer for my height this material is definitely closer to the Align collection it's so soft to wear it's so lightweight I'm actually very surprised at how closely related like this material is to it right off the bat you can see that this one has a double seam going across the front and the back of them that's different than the align leggings i think that this is an old version that lululemon used to do for aligns if i'm not mistaken but it does v in the back it even has like a little pocket inside just like the aligns do these ones i got in a size extra small and they were 17.99 so for 18 dollars again i would highly recommend that you check these out i do wish that they offered these in a size extra extra small i feel like they do run just a slightly big on me so perhaps size down in these if you want them just to be like a little bit more snug on your body so heading into my last category i'm going to group leggings and sweatpants together i'll start with these two i've shared this brand before in a previous amazon activewear haul but they have so many more colors that i had to pick up a couple more i got this gorgeous charcoal gray color and also this heather gray color too i've been on the hunt for heather gray leggings just like these this is one of two brands that i've shared that are such good align legging dupes the feeling of them it's like butter they're so freaking soft the silhouette the fit of them is just so closely related to aligns it's very high rise the seams are the same with the v in the back and the butts as well as the crotch detail seams too there are seven eighths length so the 25 inch inseam this one was 25.99 and this one was 26.99 so 26 and 27 dollars not half bad for a pair of align dupes i got these in a size extra small and i would half recommend sizing down to them i do wish that these came in an extra extra small i think i just would have loved them to be like a little bit more snug on me but regardless these leggings and even the shorts that i shared with you they are totally squat proof they are not see-through at all and these are such high quality too so definitely check these bad boys out my last pair of leggings is an obsession i am so happy i found these this is from another brand that i've recommended and have been gushing over for so long another amazon activewear video the feeling of these is as close as i found to a line leggings they're so buttery soft they're so lightweight they're so comfortable to wear these my friends these have pockets 
to those pockets. So those that have been requesting me to find really good leggings with pockets, you guys, these are them. These ones in my mind are a combination between the line leggings with pockets because of just how soft they are, but also in part the Invigorate leggings from Lululemon 2. And the reason being because of the butt. The butt of these look just like the Invigorate leggings. They are 7 8 length, about 25 inch inseam. They were 30 bucks and worth every penny. I'm so happy I found these. Go give these a try. You will not be disappointed. I'll link the same brand, but one without pockets. If you guys aren't a fan of pockets, I would definitely try those out. I mentioned those in another video and those are hands down my favorite ones. So good. Squat proof, totally comfortable, lightweight, stays up high rise, super good pair. So my very last item is a pair of sweatpants. I am so excited to be sharing a sweatpants option finally with you guys. I've bought so many pairs of sweatpants off of Amazon to try to find just like the perfect pair that's like good quality, that fits really well. And I can't believe the day is here that I definitely found a pair that is worthy of sharing with you guys. This comes in so many colors, but I got it in this gorgeous like nude color. It's called Biscotti, which I think is just so good. The fit of these are so close to a couple of my favorite ones from Aritzia. I feel like this is a combination between my Rider Dies, the basic sweatpants, but also a new favorite of mine, which is the Free Fleece. At least I think that's what they're called. It's a pair that I'm wearing right now, actually. The only difference is the fact that this does have a jawstring, which a lot of like my favorite ones from Aritzia don't have jawstrings. I actually prefer the jawstring. You know what I mean? So I love that this pair has this. The only thing I was surprised when getting them is I didn't realize it had a brand named embroidered on it to like the upper thigh. I'm honestly not too mad about it because the embroidery is the exact same color as the sweatpants. So I feel like it kind of just like blends in a little bit more. Definitely wanted to note that in case you didn't want anything on your sweatpants. They're more of a lightweight option sweatpants. They are so fleecy and soft inside you guys. So good, but I love that it's more of like a lighter weight fleecy option. The length of these are amazing and it has like an elastic cuff at the bottom of them, but I just love Love the shape of them. This sort of shape is exactly what I go for every single time I'm looking for sweatpants. Something that just like snatches your waist but provides like some flow through the leg but also doesn't go too long as well. The best part is that these were $29.98 so $30 for a really good pair of sweatpants. You guys know all the Aritzia ones, the cheapest pair is like $60 going up to like $90 so for less than a fraction of that you can get a pretty good pair of sweatpants. So I really hope that you guys enjoy these as much as I do. Well, that wraps up my Amazon activewear haul. I really hope that you guys enjoyed this video. If you have suggestions on other dupes you want me to try to find, just let me know down below. Otherwise, before you go, make sure you're giving this video a thumbs up. You are subscribed and follow me over on Instagram as well. I hope you all have a great rest of your day and I'll see you in a couple of days in my next video. Bye guys. Love you.